Hello, it's Ryan Tierney here from Lean Made Simple and I'm so excited to show you our favourite improvements for 2022. So as I was walking around taking this video, I was actually seeing improvements for the first time because all of the improvements are done by the people who are doing the actual work. None of them are my suggestions or improvements. Okay, Mickey, favourite improvement? So this is my favourite improvement this year, was uh, for the Phoenix back. These plungers and this wing nut has to go on each side. Yeah. And these two boxes here that contain them is right where you need it now. Which before they were sitting here, I was using up all this space. So now we'll be able to eliminate that and use this space for anything that we need now. Okay, Jimmy, favourite improvement for 2022? So my favourite improvement has to be a Stream Deck one and it's uh, for design proposals. So whenever I finish one, I have to convert it to PDF. So now I've got a button here straight on the Stream Deck and it does it all for me. Thank you. So this next improvement was a project that Paddy worked on for eight weeks and he made an example of every single part that we use so that if he's ever off, anyone else can step in, lift the example part and see exactly how to make that part and all the information that you ever need is on the actual part itself. So as well, out in the winter, I love this here. So I had no place for ear defenders. Now, thanks to Ben, so this we design. They sit on here, now they have a place, and they also have a label as well. Okay, Ben, favourite improvement? My favourite improvement has to be one of Paddy's. He's used the, the CNC here to make him sell a jig for the Sydney, and he's removed all struggles. So when the D-nut's been inserted, the part used to move around, but now it holds it in place. It's a brilliant improvement. Favourite improvement for 2022? Uh, this, this here we gate here, Ryan. Okay. Uh, the label gate on the backs for the Milano, and um, we can do them on the foot plates as well. It keeps everything straight, and it's right first time every time. Good job. Hey. My favourite improvement, Brian, is the one inch padded foot plate here. This, it's just sewed, there's no upholstery involved at all, no staples, and it's just a brilliant improvement and looks really great. So you've actually Thank redesigned you. it yourself? It's been redesigned, myself and Madeline worked at it, and it's a really good one. Okay. Thank you. Darling, so how many improvements do you think you've made this year? Brian, this year we've probably made at least 50, 60, 70 plus. My favourite improvement fun. is the Stream Deck. Um, we've, I've one down here at Supplies in the Kanban area and my own office. And I've added loads of great links and um, steps and everything that's just made life. Does so it make your job easier? Oh yes, definitely. Brilliant. Hey, Rebecca, what do you think of Lean? You've never, you'd never heard of Lean before starting here. What do you think of Lean? I think it's actually really interesting. Um, and I'm actually looking forward to actually delving more into it. So I've just got Paul Aker's two second lean book. So I'm looking to possibly read that over the Christmas holidays. But I think it's a great concept and you can see how well it actually works in the factory. Like it's really good. So my favorite room for this year, Ryan, is the wider frame base room. Before we had to get a separate jig, weld the feet on an angle. Um, and it took ages for Keenan to cut it and us to weld it. So now we just do it all in the one jig. The uh, feet change to standard feet, or feet as well, so it saves us about 20 minutes every chair. So this is the last day before the holidays and we have no production today. Every single person is going around cleaning and making sure the factory is absolutely perfect for coming back after the holidays. Uh, if you're improving around right, with the new kitten system that we have. Okay. So before, kitten for the welders would have been a handling for me once I came. Uh, I'd have just been throwing parts into any compartment of the box and the welders would have to be looking for it for about five minutes. And they'd have to waste their time in motion coming to ask me whereabouts in the box they'd be. So we came up with a new strategy, as you can see here, different compartments have different letters in the box. So A, B, C, D, E, F, G. So obviously A, B, C, D, E, F, G. And Keelan knows exactly. So this part is D. So this will go into this compartment and it leaves it easier for the next person in the line. Yeah, the improvements this year, it's uh, for press break. Uh, Put the steel uh, tip, uh, tip measure. Brilliant. Before we put the... Uh, so you've stuck this on? Yeah, I put magnets stuck on. Why, why is lean a good idea? Do you, do you think lean's a good idea? Lean that's to uh, make you work easy and save time, save money, everything. You, you make you easy life. So mine's is actually one of the more recent ones. So we just done this this week. Basically before, it was just a flat table. So Kieran had to manually move the boxes along. But now, whenever we lift one away, take them down. Ready to go there. So it's far better job and it saves a lot of struggle. Connor, how many improvements do you think you've made this year? Uh, I've made at least a hundred improvements this year, at least. A hundred? <laughs> Unbelievable. We can go back and check, there's, there's definitely at least that, so looking forward to maybe making 200 next year. All right, Kyle, how's it going? Not so bad. Looking forward to Christmas? Of course. I'm uh, just going to show you my favorite improvement for 2022. So this is the Denver back. This is something that bugged the hell out of me all year. Uh, 
Took us about an hour to do. We're now as we have it down to about two minutes. Um, uh, one, just, so did, did I pick it up right? One hour down to two minutes? Yeah, so one hour is two wings, half an hour each wing. So you just have to put the bolt in from this side and try and find the hole where now the bolt's in the, in the, the wing. Just put that on. These big clips we make in house. Slip it over the top and then we just tighten and that's the thing on the chair. So it's a great job. So thank you very much. Have a good new year. So my favorite improvement around is changing the bags from being upholstered to plastic. Um, Personally, it took my team down from 25 minutes down to about a minute. So definitely my favorite improvement my for you. Favorite favorite improvement is this box here and uh, skillet knobs. Okay. Before we just had one of these yellow buttons and nearly every day you were going and filling it and it was a lot of lot of waste of motion going back and forward. But now you can fill that and you can have it for maybe two weeks before you have to fill it. Brilliant, adjusting motion. Yeah. Love it, good job, John. 22. Hi Ryan, my favorite improvement for 22 is changing from the spray cans to the spray. So this year we were going through 15 of these a day and having to stock them every day. But now we use our wee spray gun and it's only one of those a day or one of those a month. So that's my favourite improvement for this year. Brilliant. Thank you. Thank you. 2022. Uh, this automatic strapper would be my favourite improvement of the year. It has made my life so much easier. It cuts about two minutes off every time I'm uh, strapping a pallet. So this year is unbelievable. Okay, no, favourite improvement for 22. Uh, so it's actually this year I'm Jake here. So um, we do our packs up here, but we have no way of checking if this year back is going to fit our cost for the first time in the way. So every part that's done, we have, they're always checked here. So we knew, know exactly every time they're going to fit. So Perfect. Okay, any favourite improvement for 22? My favourite improvement is automating the wages. So now it's took a two day process down to a few hours. My favourite improvement is bringing Power BI into the company, so now we have up-to-date data on a daily basis and no more searching for reports. My favourite improvement this year is one I made in the postage area we have over here. I added this board here, but it'll have the post box key, the tape measure for the boxes and the Franken machine labels. So now everything's in one place, whereas before it was a bit messy. So now it's all straightforward, right up to standard and everything is where you need it. Okay, Lorna, so favourite improvement? So my favourite improvement for the year is this one. I have created an app which gives me all the seating specialist postcodes and then I just put the postcode in and it tells me who the seating specialist is for that area. Unbelievable. Thank what you. do you think of Lean uh, since coming here to Seating Matters? What, what do you think of the whole concept? Um, I always thought I was a pretty organised person, but it's really kind of amazing coming and seeing how organised everyone else is, how tidy it is, how everything is a process. Um, there's nothing that ever seems to be missed. Everything's labelled, so if you go to find something, there's always instructions. You never really have to ask too many questions, which starting as new has given me a lot more confidence that I never have to ask someone again and again of what's going on. Brilliant, thank you. Favourite improvement? So my favourite improvement this year, Ryan, has been this improvement tracker. It helps me to organise my workload day to day. Uh, and what it does, the Pareto Triangle makes you focus on the 20% of the tasks that are most important that day. So Chris, I'm just noticing the detail of everything here. Your area is absolutely unbelievable. You have your double-sided tape, your laminating pouches, your magnetic tape. Every single thing you need to make a label is right here. It really is unbelievable. How many improvements do you think you've made this year, roughly? Oh. Uh, obviously, I, I, I'm here to serve the... The staff in the factory, so thousands and thousands, uh, thousands. but it all comes, all the ideas come from them. So Paddy, I think you're our number one improver in the whole company. How many improvements do you think you've made this year? I would say probably well over 500 anyway. 500? So, <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievable. Well done Paddy. Thank you. Hey Colin, so why do you think we make so many improvements here? I think there are two keys as to why we make so many improvements. I think one really important one is the WhatsApp group and everybody sharing that process of Yucatan and encouraging each other and just being part of our jobs. But also the morning meetings and when we share our favourite improvements in the morning meetings, again, that's a real encouragement when your own improvement is shared. And I think those two things uh, really help give us this culture of continuous improvement. Okay, so my favourite improvement of 2022 is these boards right behind us. So these are all our lean concepts and all our lean phrases. And this is my favourite improvement because this is where lean all starts. It starts with improving the people who improve the processes. So it's really important to teach and train every single morning at our morning meeting. So that's why these phrases right behind me is my favourite improvement. So this is another really good improvement. This is our lean library where all our lean MOOCs are on one central location that anybody in the company can go up and grab one, take it home with them and educate themselves even further on lean. I'm a firm believer that lean has the power to transform any organisation and it's really not as difficult as you may think. It's all about building a culture of continuous improvement where every single person is engaged in eliminating waste every single day. 
you would like more information on lean or information on how to get a culture of continuous improvement the way we have here, please get in touch at info at leanmadesimple.com or maybe you've tried lean in the past and you haven't got it to stick in your organization, we are here to help.